Hello, and welcome to what's about to be Stay Tuned, a, uh, a game that really took up a lot of time in my childhood. I don't know about most other people. In fact, it seems like it's not the most well-known game. Uh, it was developed by, and I'll jump in shortly, but it was developed by a studio called Funny Bone Interactive, and I think they had made like a bunch of other children's games. I don't think I had anything else from them, but I, they might have even made that... Um, that castle game that, that a lot of people are aware of, but I'm not sure. And it was published by, actually, Sierra, which, you know, they did, like, the King's Quest, the Police Quest, all the, the Quest games. And, of course, they're... I think they're still doing stuff, aren't they? Or did they get acquired? It, regardless, uh, they were the big publisher that most people knew about. But this game in particular, I, I've never met anyone else that has played it, so I don't think it was as popular as some of the other ones. Now, because of its age... We are going to use Windows 3.1 to run it, <laughs> which should be a blast. Um, I'm not going to go through Windows 3.1, but it's it's a bit of nostalgia here. Anyways, okay, Sierra, and then stay tuned, and we will jump right in. Now, this is probably going to be a chill, slow-paced gameplay through. I don't think it's a long game by any measure, but I'm not going to just speedrun the thing, if you know what I mean. So, let's get started. Get it? Funny bone. Heh. Alright, now that the logo is out of the way. By the way, th uh, this should work. I don't think anybody has these anywhere, but if you own one of those, like, anaglyphs, uh, 3D glasses, like with the red and the blue, left side, right side, you can totally wear these while you watch the- that- wear those while you watch this video. And there are several scenes in this game that have, like, the pop the pop-out experience, so feel free to don some glasses. Okay, what is your name? Boy, I don't know. Guess we'll go to save slot number one and check out this intro to end all intros. <laughs> 3D. Good old quick time. I still remember every piece of that little tune. Alright, let's chill in front of the TV and see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves into. I think my mouse, yeah, my mouse is showing up, okay. Um. Okay, some of the audio is messed up on these. I think I have to let one thing play through before let me find the most boring thing. No, 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 no. Okay, this one. As soon as this plays through to the end, I think it'll fix the audio for the commercials. I think. Hopefully there's no other problems in the game, but who knows. There probably is. If this is. had been an actual emergency, we, we would have called your mother. Repeat, this is only... <laughs> Whoops! Okay, Bob, you can stop now. Let's go ahead and watch the commercials. Five, 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 five. Supplies are extremely limited. Well, they're not that limited, but they're somewhat limited. They're really limited. Well, if they were limited, I wouldn't be doing this ad, but we really gotta sell them something. They're not that limited, but they will be limited if you order some. If this had been an actual emergency, we Next. would have called your mom. There we go. This is your brain. <sighs> this is your brain on Schlepperty. This is Al Extra Which you can actually play down the road in this game. Weekdays with at Al four. Extra Bucks. 
I missed a fishy grinning, so happy that I'm spinning. I'm smiling on the label, cause I'm going to your table. So you can slice and dip me, Mr. Fishy Herring Snacks. Herring Snacks. Wine filled. <laughs> Real punny, 90s humor. So I didn't watch Seinfeld, but uh, <laughs> somewhere you get it. The coast of Nantucket, the perfect terrorist plot, but they didn't count on one thing. Steven Seagal is in the line of danger. Steven no, Seagal. No, no, listen to me. I said release the political prisoners. Send in a helicopter and give us one million pickled anchovies in a numbered Swiss bank account. I'm just a bird. <laughs> yeah. Frauds. <laughs> Bunch of dummies. All right, I think that's most of the commercials. Uh, one, five, five. Yeah. If this had been okay, let's action. go back to this one. It's just another beautiful day, isn't it? Oh, look, a defenseless little Boydy. Hello, little Boydy. I'll take you home and feed you and everything. I'll give you your own nice little cake, and I'll put newspaper under it. This is wonderful. Wow! Yeah! Whatever you do, don't hit the red button. I'm not going to hit the red button, actually. If I do, it'll start the game, and we'll see these wonderful little uh, channels. Hi, I'm Ben. I'm the oh, programmer boy. for all this madness. There are a couple things which I wanted to let you know before you get started. First of all, if you play through and win, you should go back and play again because I can guarantee things will be different. When you go back, you may see some animations that you've seen before. If so, you can hold down the control key and click, and that should get you onto the next bit. While you're clicking around, keep your eyes on the cursor because it will usually change to tell you where things are, but it might not always, so don't trust it. Also, out in the hallway, you'll see a map on the back wall. This will keep track of where you've been Jesus, and what you've done. Keep giving away all of our secrets! And one more thing, and this is really I'll important. I'll take care of him. <laughs> Get pied. At least it was chocolate. Yeah. I'll take care of this little nerd! I'm ben, Back in the I'm days the where programmers the recorded themselves to give advice. To you know. Somewhere. Okay, another ad channel. I can't believe I lost another customer. Oh, wait till I get my hands on those two. I know they're around here somewhere. Pixel, Jizzle, Front and Center! <laughs> that is Frank, by the way. Sorry, my sister blew up your store. You're the one who put the eggs in the microwave. But you're the one that pressed the start button. What does it matter? We still gotta make it up to Frank. Let's let bygones be bygones. Please. Give the man a cigar. Nothing like a good cigar. Try one of these. They're from Havana. Let's blow this joint. Yeah. Red button. No, we're gonna go through the rest of the channels first, sir. Nope. Ads, all these ads. Oh my goodness! Well, my my. Looks like if you come back here after midnight, <laughs> the XXX files pay-per-view special just ninety-nine ninety-five. Well, <laughs> next. This is a family-friendly channel. Usually. Ads. Our last channel. Personals. I'm gonna find me a little sweetie pie. Hey, Scoops. What are you doing in my paper? Lovely. When I said sweetie pie, that's not what I meant. <laughs> All right, here we go, red button time. We'll be busting out with more cartoon adventures, so stay tuned!
moon. Hey, Chisel, did he say bust it out? That's the magic word. Oh, man. Oh, no, everything was so realistic. For you. you won't be needing it. <laughs> All right. Here we are. Oh no! Those tunes have escaped again, and they'll run around your apartment building, ruining everything. It's up to you to catch them. But first, you'll have to find the remote. The remote will let you zap, schmooze, scoop, fiddle, pixel, and chisel back into TV land. So, oh, hey, hi. dummy, don't you <laughs> get it? This building's been tuned. You'll be trapped here forever unless you find the TV remote and zap those tunes back to TV land. You got to look in all the apartments. Oh, sure, some of them are locked, and you'll have to figure out where Pixel and Chisel hid the keys. Top. So get out of here, and watch out, because us tunes are going to make your life miserable. If you say so. Oh, man, where do I even start? Wow. I guess I'll just start clicking things. <laughs> I love cartoon sounds. Oh. Okay. Well, uh, guess I gotta clean it up. Oh, look at that technology right there. Alright. Good enough. Oh, let's play the thing. Okay, I was never very good at this. What is this? Can you help Scoops defeat Dr. Pickles? I don't know. Arrow keys. Find these objects and bring them to the lab. Return two objects to the lab to have them combined into a dangerous destructive device. Okay. So I have to do that one, two, three, four times. Throw the destructive devices into the funnels to destroy the monster machine. Okay. And I can also use them to move around. So here's some monsters. Here's some teleporters. And the last object is Dr. Pickles' brain. All right, let's... Do this, I guess. Just arrow keys, I guess. Oh, he just keeps walking. Okay. Oh, I remember the music. Uh, and I already died. Cool. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Ah! Oh, oh, nope, nope, nope. Little tricky. Okay, that's one. Okay, then I have to get another one. Oh man, eyeballs. Oh, I can't get it like that. Uh, how do I get that thing? Oh, I know. This one, maybe. There it is. Alright. And then... Yes. A thing that says die. <laughs> Yikes, that was close. And all I have to do is bring it into the funnel, I think. Ah! Okay, well, that was dumb. I forgot that was a... I forgot that was a thing. Do I still have the... D Wait. Wait, where'd my... Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh... No! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try that again. Oh, I'm on the last one. Okay. Okay. 
And... Okay, one down. Okay, we're fine. Everything is fine. How do I get to that one spot over there? With the green on the bottom left there. Oh, no. Man, games within games back then were pretty cool. Okay, here's one thing. Get this one at the top here. Oh, there's how I get to the other one. Okay. Good to know. Destructo device number two. I'm never going to be able to finish this on my last life, but that's fine. Oh, uh, I'm glad I turned around there. That was close. Yes, go back in the thing. Oh, you can't. Mm. Just waiting for him to go somewhere else. Come on. Okay, tell you what. Okay, that's not working out too well for me. Okay, can't really go that way either. Mm, now I can. Oh, wait, what am I doing, man? Uh, I was supposed to just carry to the funnel. I was, like, trying to pick up another piece. Oh, really? <laughs> no! Uh, okay, I will try one more time. I did say this would be a slow play. Hey, I got the highest score, at least. Alright, here we go. Let's get the farthest ones first, shall we? This one. Okay, that should do it for one. I just have to bring it to the machine. And hopefully not run right into somebody. TV one, I believe. Okay, that works. I like how he just walks very fast. I don't know if they're coded to, like, track me down or not. It doesn't seem like it. Alright, this will be half of them. Hmm. 
Now there's only the purple glop and the green aliens, I guess, left. Shortcuts. Where's the other items, anyway? I guess the rest could just be hidden. I think there's one behind the chair up there. And I have no idea where the other... Maybe the antenna? Alright, what will this destroy? Oops, okay. Okay. Antenna. Nope. What about... No, I'm pretty sure it's behind the chair. I just don't know where the other one is. Yikes! How am I alive? Oh, wow. That was unbelievably close. Well, I found the underpants. Scoops. One more item to find. I have no idea where it is. I totally forget. Oh, it's him. Ah, okay. Yikes. Got him. Alright, here we go. get anything for that, but that was fun. Now, how do I... Ah. Alright, so let's try to leave our apartment. Fiddle here. I'm on your side. Click everywhere until you've got that remote. It's the only way we're gonna fix things. Can we leave? You need to type in the password and press return. Back when enter key used to press... used to be called return... Uh, let's see. Well, I think I remember there was a key hidden in the shoes. Let me see if it's still there. Maybe not. Uh, hold on. Let me try that again. Ah. The door was blocking it. I don't think the keys are in the exact same spots every time. I mean, there's predefined spots for them, but I could be wrong. Okay. Now, left or right? Left, I believe, is the bathroom. Right's the kitchen. Uh, we're gonna go to the kitchen, because why not? You locked all of the apartment doors, right, old news brother of mine? Of course, those wimps will never find all of the keys. Oh, oh but we will. What's up, MBM? Welcome to the 90s. <laughs> Alright, you ready to hear some music? These guys only know one song, but they sing it very well. We only know one song, we sing it all day long. If you make a request, we will sing it with zest, and we'll ask you to sing right along. Did I mention they only know one song? We only know one tune, we'll sing it until 
until you swoon. To us it's delish, but I know that you wish that our singing would stop fairly soon. I mean, I could listen to that for hours. I don't know what they're talking about. All right, let's click some things. See if we can find some keys. Or, um, nope. Found a serpent, though. Sure, cabinet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's creepy. This is amazing. Oh, get me out of this thing. Sashimi. Gotcha. Get the schmig off of me, you stinking animal. Yeah, this glass is gooey. Oh, disgusting. Oh, oh I hate these darn tunes. Stupid tunes. Keys. Oh. <laughs> now, the best part of the kitchen. Hold on. There's two best parts. Get to them in a second. <laughs> the sound. Uh, the best part of the kitchen, number one, is this song. My favorite thing makes me jump for joy, makes my heart want to sing. But the way to my heart is not through my head. I don't want a hug, give me a food instead. If it's boozy or moldy or smelly or oldy, sour or soggy, I'm a happy doggy. Sloppy or creamy, bluish or greeny, put it in a cup and I'm a happy pup. Come, let me tell you about my favorite thing. Makes me jump for joy, makes my heart want to sing. Mood. And the plate. All right, now that we've overfed our dog, let's do the actual game. Prepare to meet your doom, you ignorant monkey person. You Prepare ignorant to meet monkey your person. Doom, you ignorant monkey person. All right, let's go. It's basically uh, what's that, what's that game? Galaga. It gets a, progressively a little bit harder as it, well, wow, well, I ran right into that one. Oh, well, I can do the rest on one life. Man, the sound. Just quality sound. Things are dropping faster. Face me, the overbug. The overbug. I have to hit him like five or six times, I think. Hey, extra life. I'll 
so let me use this. Woo! A little tricky to catch him as he comes out. Hey, you got lucky. Oh man, a couple more hits, he'll be done. Look at him, look at his eyes. He's, he's upset. Toontown? I'm not familiar with that. Oh, I almost... Come on. You can do it. I'll use another fizz. Ah, well, that was useless. Alright, one more. Should do the trick. No! I have extra lives, it's fine. Um, oh, almost. Come on. of me, but I'll be back. I actually don't remember if he shows up again at any point during the game. Probably not. Well, he might. There might be like a mini game or something within a minute. Hey, look who got the high score again. Press score to engage in combat. Hang on, I'm gonna hang around here just long enough for him to say the line. Press go, you idiot! There it is! <laughs> Press go, you idiot! Alright, we're, we're done with the kitchen. Time for the bathroom. I think the shampoo has a key. Yes. Hairspray. Yes. There's the password. We'll come back to that. Hey, no cracks. It's Mr. Fishy. Say, <laughs> put a lid on it. Bottoms up. <laughs> bathroom humor at its finest. Alright, my favorite thing to do in the bathroom? Change what comes out of the pipes. Good old water is always fun, or why not syrup? That is a strange sound. It's almost, it's like it's satisfying, but it's also pretty disgusting. Let's try the pudding. And then of course, you gotta have the gravy. Except... Oh, of course. Catch me without the meat loop. That's a hint. That's an end game hint. Don't need that for a while. All right, let's check the bathtub. Sure. All right, let's go put that password in and leave. Our apartment. Also, something just to type in the password and press return. Something just dawned on me. When I was younger, I always thought this was a hotel. It's not a hotel. It's an apartment complex. It's probably because I didn't live in the city. I don't know what those things are. Apartment complex? What's that? I guess I can let you buy now. 
Das Boot. Why are there so many doors? Okay, we're on floor four. Okay. <laughs> 4A is our apartment. Uh, every one of these doors is usually randomized. There are some exceptions. Okay. Took the remote upstairs. Stuff you found, nothing. Fifth floor, cellar. Okay. I think you always start out with like the, th the room 3D and 2B. Maybe one or two more. We, we found, what, two keys or something? So, two of them are actually on the floor we are. The, the keys, the places that you find are always randomized, and what's in the rooms are always randomized. And I can't remember if there are extra ones that you have to find on an additional playthrough. Like, there's more rooms than there are rooms, if that makes sense. Or not. But... Let's check... Here. Here. Do yeah. something, please! Let's check this little fancy animation. Grab some water. I'm the smartest tune. My brain is unsurpassed. And if you don't believe me, I'll kick you in the... Ask me what I'd like to do. <laughs> I'd love to play some tricks on you. Whatever you say sticks right back to you. So I 90s. Mean, I got the brains in this family. And obviously I got the good looks. We're identical twins, stupid. <laughs> We're identical twins, stupid. We mimic so well, just like a monkey. Just like a monkey. Do you stop interrupting me? I'm not interrupting you. <laughs> but she's my sister. And he's my brother. And, and we, we really love each other. Oof. And they're dead. What's all the racket here? Oh, it's you, the one that lives in 4A. You've got me taters in a boil. You know the rules. Quiet now. <laughs> How did I never realize she was Irish? That's Mrs. Findley, the owner. Okay, let's explore. What's in room? Oh wow, right off to here. Okay. What are you doing? Roaming around. <laughs> Choose your ammo. <laughs> Aim and fire. Okay. To fire projectiles at the gladiators, choose one of the objects on your left. Pull back the bowstring and aim with your mouse and then let it go. There's some Easter eggs in here, actually, that was really hard for me to find, but I always liked when I did. Let me see if I can find, like, a... <laughs> yeah, they're laughing because I'm not hitting them, but sometimes if you miss, you'll hit, like, this Minotaur or something else, so sometimes in between the pillars. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> so gotta do all the arrows. I think you can hit, like, other stuff. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to actually hit them. Bushes. Oops, hit her already. Oh, 
Come on. Let's pick the anvil. All right, let's start taking out the, uh, the gladiators. <laughs> Come on. I love this. Poor Pesquel. He didn't do anything. All right, let's start taking out the pillars. Yeah. All right, what about... There we go. What about the bomb? You fool! You fool! Well, that wiped that scowl off his face. He always looks so happy until he doesn't. I don't know the purpose of this, but it's fine. Alright, let's take out the pillars. Perfect. Come on! And the lion. There he goes. Now see, that was the Easter egg animation right there. Normally it doesn't show. I'm trying to get the Minotaur as well. But... Let me try the Anvil? Maybe it only works with certain... There it is. Okay. Is there not a key in here? Huh, maybe not. Okay, guess I'll leave then. They're at the end of the hall. We're gonna hear that a lot. What's in 4C? Oh. Uh, can't you read the sign? This is a private beach. No trespassing. Says the guy in his sister's bathing suit. Hey Frank, you look like you could do some electrolysis. Ah, uh, electro <laughs> Hit the road, loser. I'll show you a hit. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Frank ruined a perfectly good beach day. Oh no, sand sharks. Yeah, and now we're at your mercy. If you play this game, we'll give you something special. Here's how to play. Listen to the sequence of our sayings, and then knock us on the head in the same order. Now listen carefully. Knock us on the head? It's our only chance. Some chance. Oh. I was always bad at these type of games. Not bad, I just don't enjoy them. Okay. Oh, 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 oh,
Still? These poor three. Really? Finally. It wasn't sand sharks. It was sand beetles. <laughs> beetles? Who are the beetles? I'm getting too old for this. Has anyone seen Baraja? I can't get these bloody tunes out of my head. I've got a hole in my pocket. I thought we were going skiing. And the way go the sand beetles. Woo, yeah. <laughs> no. What I will do, though... Oh! Come on, you ain't so bad! <sighs> okay. See, games in the 90s, you just don't question them. Okay, I'm not going to play that again. I am... No. I'm going to go in here. This humidity is killing me. Sure. Weren't you just in the sand? Okay, there's a game here. That, uh... Can't you fan any faster than that? Why I oughta turn that thing off, you crazy mutt! <laughs> Poor Scoops. Time for some entertainment. Send in the belly dancer. The belly dancer. Now that's jamming. I said belly dancer, not jelly dancer. Smelly dancer. Then Who loves you, baby? Jeez, not the belly dancer. The <laughs> belly dancer already. See? If I don't see a belly dance right now, there'll be trouble. <laughs> Scoop space. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's do the game, then I'll wrap it up. The genie. I am the genie of the land. I will grant you one wish, Scoops. whatever it may be. <laughs> I wish. I wish for some explosive excitement. A dynamite blonde on a Persian rug? Okay. Solve the you puzzle before this back together or this genie's going to the moon. Before the genie goes to the moon. Click Got quickly it. on a square to make it spin. Okay. Oh, so hard, let me tell you. Something like that. No, it's the top right. Wrong side. That's this side. Um. I actually don't know where that goes. i put that there. Put this way over here. Oh, this is in the wrong spot, that's why. 
Maybe. Hang on. No, that's the wrong spot too. There we go. Hey, here's a key. Thanks for the entertainment. Anytime, bro. Having a little trouble finding the remote? Maybe some extra curses would help. I love that. And again, maybe not. They seem to have a mind of their own. Curse it. Curse it. <laughs> so many dad jokes. Hey, I got my cursor back. It's a little too big. I feel like it wasn't supposed to be that big, but who knows. Okay, let's see what happens if we try to click on a door we don't have the key for. Or maybe we do at this point. Uh, no, we do not. So. Oh. The trick here is my hands work faster than your eyes. Seeing is believing. Now, you gotta pick which shell the key is under. Go ahead, pick a shell. Boy, is it this one? Sorry, sucker. Well, then it must be this one. Nothing. Nick's not a Oh, well, obviously. It's the middle one. Sorry. Zip. Zero. Zilch. That's strange. Where could it be? Well, what about... Why I oughta... I wonder how that happened. Heh <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Sorry, you don't have a key for this door. Ah, uh, yes, there they are. Okay, I knew I saw them again at some point. Now, this is annoying. Come here, you. Yeah, every time you basically go to the change screens, there's like a little interruption. Some of them are fun, some of them are ridiculously stupid, some are just annoying. Um, but yeah, that's all I have time for right now. Um, man, this brings back a lot of memories. I mean, obviously I played other games, but this was, for some reason, I don't even know where I got this. It might have been like a catalog order or something, who knows. Oh, apparently if you just wait here. That can happen too. here we go. Ah, uh, he got my cursor. I never said I wasn't tacky. <laughs> this puts you in a sticky situation. Huh. How do I actually leave the program? Escape, I think? Yes. Okay. Alright. This has been Stay Tuned Episode 1. What is it, about an hour? Yeah. Um, next time, maybe Thursday or Friday, I might do another one. We'll see. And uh, it's it's really not a long game. You know, games when you're a kid, the games seem to last a lot longer because you can spend days. I don't know if it's the skill level or if you just you spend more time clicking around or what. But I remember. I mean, we I, I played that pretty pretty consistently for it felt like a, a few years at least. But who knows? Maybe I'm just my sense of time is all messed up or something. But anyway. Until next time, thanks for watching. See you later.